This is the new Asphalt game, Asphalt Street Storm Racing. You've probably noticed it looks completely different from its predecessors. That's because it's focused on drag racing, and it borrows a lot from the current king, CSR Racing. There's one substantial change though, that will inevitably divide players. While most drag racing titles place the emphasis on keeping the needle in the sweet spot, Asphalt Storm has included a new launch button. It lets you choose when you wish to set off, provided you don't cross the starting line before the countdown ends. Hit it right and you'll gain an extra second over your opponent, but get it wrong and you'll be disqualified instantly. It's meant to add another layer of strategy that doesn't translate so well in practice. With drag races lasting 15 seconds or less, it places too much emphasis on getting the launch right. The good thing is that you're never losing for too long. Since races are so short, you can cram in a game or two at any time. That's great for when you're on the go, though the game's always online requirement can be annoying. And since it's a free-to-play title, you have the usual troubles, pop-up ads and car upgrades that take hours after the first level, which prod you to make in-app purchases to speed things up. Unless you're a dedicated Asphalt fan, there's little to no reason to bother with its drag racing spin-off. All its borrowed ideas are better executed by CSR Racing, and the new ones fail to push the tried and tested concept in a satisfying direction. Thanks for watching. Hit the like button below and subscribe to our channel. You can also follow us on Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram at Gadgets360.